Hey babes, to start off, I'm putting on my Summer Fridays jet lag mask for moisturizer. Next, you cannot forget your sunscreen. Make sure you put it on your neck as well. Next, I'm going in with my Benetton. This is in 4.5, which is medium brown, I think. To hold down my brows, I'm just using the e.l.f. brow lift. So I know that my brows are pretty full for the most part, but I like to use this to fill in any parts of my brows that are lighter than the other just so I can make it all even. Now that the brows are finished, I'm going in with my e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. This stuff is pretty much like the Milk Primer. I love it and it makes my face super tacky, which means that my makeup will stay on. And prior to all this, as you can tell from my hands, I did some fake tan and I did add a little bit to my face, which I will suffer from the consequences later. But um, yeah, just in case it looks a little muddy or blotchy around my cheekbones and nose area, it's because I do have a little bit of fake tanner on. But you just gotta keep blending and work through it, and plus concealer will clean all of that up, so it's not that bad. Next I'm going in with my e.l.f. Coconut Setting Spray. Next I'm going in with my Dior in 2N. This is pretty much my foundation at this point. Now I'll use my other Dior Skin Correct in a lighter shade. This is 0N and I'll go in on the points of my face that I want to be highlighted or brighter than the rest. Carving out my brows now with that same shade in 0N and it's so satisfying to just clean up the brows especially after I do them because I usually never fill in my brows. Before I blend all of it out, I'm just adding Malaya from Refi. And the brush that I'm using to blend everything out is from Real Techniques.
now it's finally time to bake. I am going to take some translucent powder from one size. I love this powder. It's not too cakey. I am still trying to figure out why it gets balled up when I first take it out though, but it hasn't been an issue yet just because I know how to tap off excess product, but yeah, I do like this powder a lot. You know that I do not depend on nothing or no one So why would you show up so uninvited Can just change my mind like that Please don't take this personal But you ain't shit You ain't special till I made you so You better act like you know That I've been through worse to you Next is nose contour and I'm going to be using this Chanel finishing powder. Everybody's like he's no item. Please don't like him. He don't wife him. Hey. Yeah. I need someone to be patient with me. Someone to get me. I'm just retouching the powder in the areas that we baked and I'm gonna go in with liner. I use the KISS eyelash glue liner, but it doesn't really hold your lashes. I just use it for the liner. Okay, so after that, I just curl my eyelashes and get ready to put on some mascara, which is of course from L'Oreal. And yeah, I've been having this little secret surprise come out. I know I've been getting a lot of questions about my eyelashes and for such a long time, I could never find the eyelashes that I want in stores and it's so difficult to find the style and the length that I want so I decided why not put all of them in one place so that's what I'm gonna be doing it should be out around February and I'm so excited to show everybody and put them on my website all of them will be my go-to lashes and these are lashes I even brought to my model meetings as we're getting ready I pull them out and they replace the lashes that they're gonna wear with those and then they end up using the same lashes on other models I have different styles that can be worn for classic looks and for full glam looks so I'm super excited I just need y'all to be a little bit more patient with me and I cannot wait to show everybody it just takes a lot of time to pick out exactly what I like and how I want to style everything when I present it to y'all but yeah I'm a perfectionist and I want to make sure that it's perfect so thank you so much for being patient they're so cute okay now it's time for a lip liner this is charlotte tilbury in the shade iconic nude Pink sugar from Summer Fridays, y'all know I'm obsessed with the smell. My lips are peeling a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> 
wiping off any excess powder. And my favorite pink to your blush. But there's no drug around. But that's what I found. You, you. I still can't feel my face. Using my cream freckle pen for beauty marks. Can you taste? Little taste. Now it's finally time for highlight and I'm going in with this Dior highlight palette and just wetting my brush before. And for smaller areas like my inner eye, I'll use Fenty Beauty in Lightning Dust and Fire Crystal. That's about it. Yeah, that's about it. That is it for the completed look. I even have my Victoria's Secret jammies and slippers on. <laughs> I love you so much. Thank you all for watching. I take video suggestions in the comments. And until next time, bye.